think as you get older, you feel more confident. And, you know, my ethos is just do little and often, keep moving, just keep moving. Well, but I want to know your secret for feeling more confident. I just feel it's too late. No. I mean, there's so many people going to be listening to you and watching and they're going to say too late. But we do have to say for you, 69 years of age, right? And, and it wasn't as if you took this up a long time ago. You had a bit of a health scare, hadn't you, in yes. your 60s? About seven years ago, uh, I had a brush with cancer. Um, and I felt physically everything was great. Um, after my treatment, I went back to the gym because I was a great gym bunny. And I sat there thinking, no, nope, don't want to be here. Yeah. I want to be out in the fresh air, free fresh air. But I still wanted to keep her strong. And that's the key word, strong, as we get older as well. Mm. Um, so I started walking with weights. Um, they didn't, um, they couldn't, you couldn't increase the weightage. Yeah. And then if you were on a four mile walk, you would end up like an orangutan by the time you got yeah. back. So um, I say at 65, I didn't retire. I restarted. I became an inventor. Wow. And I invented InStep, which is a walk-in resistance pair of bands. So, so what, these bands go around your ankles or something, do they? They go in your shoe, under your foot, like yeah. a stirrup. Uh -huh. And you have a pair of them. It's attached to a rubber tube, a handle, and you walk... And, and you move. literally can walk while you, you're doing You this. can walk. You can go in the water. You can go in your house. You can go in the garden. You just walk and sort of tone, do anything you want with and them. And toning was a big thing for you then. It was, a, was this about how you looked? Were you wanting to have those lovely, what do they call them, cocktails, uh, cocktail arms? I love, those... yeah, defined yeah. arms. And with resistance training, it gives you shape and strength. It's proven to be the best form of strengthening exercise. And if you combine that with cardio, yeah. it's the golden ticket of exercise. It has been, I hate this word, this phrase, scientifically researched, <laughs> and it has been proven well, to it's be... It's not just... You, said, you mentioned exercise there, but actually I'm looking at you and I'm re, you know, looking back at your story, and a lot of it's about health, because as you get older, osteoporosis, you've got yep. to strengthen your bones. That's it. So it's that impact. So walking, as we know, you don't have to run marathons, triathlons. You know, we're meant to move yes. as human beings. We're not meant really to climb the Himalayas unless you live there. And there's too much pressure, I think, on people having to go and, you know, beat the, the, the latest record. Whereas it's got to be part of your lifestyle and your day so you can... Do it, and subliminally, you're doing exercise all day long without knowing about it. And for a lot.